Rosvelger, Ekthnir, Skull and Hadi, Needhogger, Retatusker. All of the demonic beast battles that are available in Grand Cross's history. And today we're going to do the demonic beast gauntlet. So what that is, it's really simple. We're just going to run through all of them, but we're going to use Shion on every single team. And we're only going to give them all one attempt. So if I lose with like RNG purposes and I can win it, I'm just going to say, okay, that's an L. We go to the next one. We give every single one one attempt to see how broken this PVE Shion really is. Now, before I load into this one, I would like to say like and subscribe, okay? I'm on the road to 1,000 subs and I really need y'all guys' support. So that I would very much love if y'all were to support the channel. Now, with that being said, I do have a mistake I want to call out is that I gave Milum Tarmio Link on accident and I wasn't paying attention. Tarmio Link should be on Shion. That being said, if I lose, it's probably because I don't have Tarmio Link on Shion and he loves targeting her because green, I guess. I'm not entirely sure why, but yeah. So that being said, again, like, subscribe, one attempt per Demonic Beast battle with Shion on every single team. Let's run it and let's go ahead and see what's happening and then, like with bird specifically he is really easy especially for four even before shion and milo came out he was i wouldn't say he was really easy it's still rng dependent in a sense right but now with milam and shion bird floor four is like, like easy breezy cakewalk unless you're me and your rng sucks then you might have a little bit of an issue but for the most part it's really straightforward and it's really easy as long as you understand what the gimmicks are for each floor you'll be fine and phase one doesn't have a gimmick is she just a really tanky birdie nothing insane and then phase two you want to go into phase two with three rank twos so from the looks of it i'm gonna end up saving my Shion cards even though i do have a lot of minimum cards that are pretty good I think I might save Milum. So, as you can see, yeah, my Shion's getting targeted because I accidentally gave Tarmel Link to the person with like infinite HP. So that was a mistake on my end for sure. Uh, let's just mer not, maybe merge. Let's not waste our time. Let's pop this. Throw the power strike out. Throw this out. And then throw the other power strike out. I'm gonna save the heal for next turn because genuinely speaking, knowing my luck, I'm not gonna see another heal for seven turns. So I at least wanna. Heal when it's necessary. Okay. Oh, he's not targeting Shion this time. Holy. That's a first. Alrighty. He is nullified, but that's good. Because I can now cleanse the nullify. So, good for us. We cleanse that. And we use this level 2. We do that. And we move that. So, we have three level 2s going into it. I think Milum can kill here. As long as I... I did cleanse the... Did I not cleanse the Nullify? I, I didn't cleanse the Nullify from Milum. That's not the best. I was expecting to cleanse the Nullify. If I did, I would have killed him. Somehow, I just did it, though. So, yay me. Let's heal. Hopefully, it cleanses this time. And then, we can just go lay in all these extra cards that we have. Probably won't kill. Because I don't have anything procced for these two characters that I'm using. But it's fine. Never mind. She did way more damage than I thought she would. And yeah, the Thor kills easy. I didn't realize she was doing that much damage. Jesus. Okay. Now we got our level threes and stuff. So, boom, boom, boom. And let's just ult with Magelda. Since we can. So I don't have any faith that Shion's gonna keep her shield for the next turn. So there's really no point in me saving that Shion card either. But again, he can either target Shion or what is up with Magelda's ultimate? It's been really bugging me. Like ever since like update, Magelda's ultimate just freezes for whatever reason. It freezes my whole game for like a little second, as you can clearly see. But yeah, he targeted the hell out of Shion, so yeah, she her attack aren't going to do anything. So it's up to Melum and company, which is fair and fine. I'm not mad at that. We need this. I waste that. I waste that, and then I'll AOE. I might kill. I should easily kill, actually. All of our cards have, like, death on them, so they proc extra damage over the damage cap. Easy. That was a quick phase. The phase three is the fun part. Immortality. And I did not pull a Thor. I did not pull a... Oh, wait. I have an ultimate. Okay. That works. Thor's ultimate works just fine. 
Boom. Boom. Let's let's heal. Actually, okay. Let's heal first. Heal. Amplify. Amplify. And then Thor card to get rid of the damage increases that you get for not using a Thor card. Boom. 481. Too bad he has invincibility. Otherwise, this could probably get cleared in two or three turns. Shit, even one if I was actually maximizing damage instead of removing immortality. It's a fun experience. Buffs are disabled. Screw you, buddy. Yeah, as you can see, my Shion's gonna get smacked. So if I don't cleanse, the, if I don't get a heal, my Shion could be in trouble because I just didn't put a time link on her, and he does not like Shion. So amplify. We have an amplify from Miguelda. We can merge that to get more cards, and then throw it out. And for some reason, like, I don't know if Power Strike removes an immortality per se, but Magelda's ultimate removes an immortality as well, which is very interesting. Now, as you can see, he has four immortalities, but even if I had four things to remove for immortality and then the death effect proc, he would still live. I did try that out at one point, and it was just like, okay, huh, I guess that's not going to happen. But, I mean, we don't have enough to cleanse these anyway. So let's just heal here. This is waste this. Waste the ultimate here. And just get the Thor out, I guess. See, power strike. Oh, power strikes do remove immortalities. Huh. Well, I couldn't remove um, all of the immortalities that turn anyway, because it was four and not, you know, I didn't have four power strikes and amplifies. But okay, power strike does remove immortalities. I didn't know that. I thought it was just strictly Thor cards and amplifies. But yeah, power strikes do work. That makes a lot of sense. I mean, I, I, I guess I kind of figured out it would be that way in one sense or another. Just do that. And then this will be done with phase three. Easiest phase three of my life. Because Shion is cracked for this. She has power strike and amplify the things that the bird hates. 600k, baby. 600k. And she full heals. That's crazy. And then for the last phase, it's just kill him. I'm pretty sure he has a revive at, or a full heal at 30% HP. Right? Um... Yeah, I don't remember. Oh, is it this one? Uh, yeah, don't remember. But we could probably one bang him. Let's be honest. I have such Milum cards. I'm pretty sure I can just one tap him. So we do this with Milum. We do this. We do this, and we amplify with Shion, and he should just die. 750, 600. Okay, maybe he won't die. 526. So does he have a fucking revive here? Oh, he has an attack up. That's a problem. If he wipes my team or not, you know, that, that could be a problem. But my tanking is looking pretty good. So, yeah, we win. That's fine. Damn! But, yeah, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We heal. We ult. We pop this. We use Amplify with Shion again, I guess, because I only have Shion cards. And then we should pretty much just kill. Ooh, maybe not. Shion does negative damage with all of those debuffs. Come on, Shion. Come on, Shion. Thank you. Never mind. You're still goaded. Easy, bird clear, and now we move on <sighs> to the next one. Damn, damn, Jesus, Shion, my God. Hey, good, re good, good RNG-ish. Let's go. All right, now it's time for Ekthnir. Ekthnir. Now apparently this isn't like the best setup for a Shion build. Instead of Yormaganda, you want to use um Freyr. But I'm going to be honest, do I'm going to get it so broken, I can't be bothered to try out Freya's setup. I think I'll be fine here. I'm going to be I'm gonna be real honest. So, I haven't played Deer in a very long time. It's been a minute. But it's still straightforward and still pretty simple. You just have to, you know, attack with different characters to get the rank ups and then just go from there. And whoever attacks twice loses. What the fuck is going on here? First off, his health is gone. Phase 1 is crazy. What the hell? Did he get nerfed at some point? I don't recall them nerfing deer, but Jesus, that man just got obliterated. All right, um, green. Shit. I don't think there is a color code for this face yet. Right? Is there a color code? Uh, might as well just do it the other. Just in case. Just in I mean, that's still fucking wrong, but it's fine. Is there a color code for this face? There is. There is. What happens here? What happens here? Do I get attack disabled? Eh, I can deal with that. I can deal with that. We'll, we'll wait to, what, two turns or so? I'm fine with that. He literally doesn't even do damage anyway. That's fine. Boom, boom, boom. All right. Let's just waste those. Jesus, dear. 
Jesus, dear. All right, now we can do it properly. So yeah, blue probably dies to that one card. If not, boom, dies to that, and then we'll just waste these two. Oh yeah, like I said, dies to the one card because store is broken. It's still and phase three. There's nothing. You just go through it, and with that, we'll just boom, boom, ult, then she on again. 121. She did no damage there. Oh, I guess he has a damage cap of 121. Bitch, I left him on 1 HP. Because Jormungandr didn't hit damage cap, I left him on 1 HP. Or technically like 2,000, but you know what I mean. That's kind of fucked up. Let's do a Jormungandr heal. Why not? Yes, sir. Heal up the squadron. Because Jormungandr is broken. She's still level 90 for me. That's how I know I haven't done deer in a long time. The fact that she's still level 90 is kind of nutty. Alright, easiest game of all time. Green with the blue follow-up. Oh, that's not blue. Fuck, my name's not blue. Green with the blue and the red. Then back to green. Probably one bang. Oh yeah, he's dead. GG's. Everyone hits damage cap, probably. Yep, everyone hits damage cap. What's up with my game freezing like this, bro? What is going on? I don't understand. Alrighty, phase two. Or floor two. You know what I mean. Same difference, but instead, we have to mess up the rotation on the first rotation to get frozen and not get wiped. So as long as I do that properly, we're fine. So, boom, boom. Actually, no. Let's do this. Doom, doom, doom. It's just AoE with her. Should probably wipe. Maybe. Yeah, we're fine. She gets the rank up, too. Yeah, we're, we're, we're wiping here. Boom, boom, boom. Easy. Good job, Melum. Now, this is the one we gotta mess up, right? I don't remember if it's the first one or the second one, then that's gonna piss me off. Oh, no, 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 it's the second one. So, let's see here. Green, blue, red, green. No, is this the one where you mess up? Shit, that's gonna zone me out. Okay, I don't think this is the one. I think it's the, sec the next turn where you have to mess it up. You do this to remove the, you know, the damage reduction thing. But I'm pretty sure the next turn is the one where you want to mess up on purpose. And not the first turn. If it's the second one, or if it's the first one, I'm going to be so pissed. Because, like I said, I'm only doing each of them one time. So, if he just decides to wipe my team here, we're skipping it and going to the next one. Because I fucked up. It looks like I'm safe. Yeah, okay, okay. So it's the next one where you have to mess it up on purpose. Thank God. Alright. Uh, so we got blue. Red. Into the green. And then we'll freeze the Shion if she's not immune to debuffs. Hopefully she isn't. Because I need a frozen character in order to get fucked. Or she can just die. That works too, actually. Yeah, who needs gimmicks when you could just literally kill it in two turns? Who needs gimmicks? Silly, silly aura expert. What, what were you thinking? What a, what a guy. What a guy. Boom. Boom. Thor. And then let's just follow up with another Thor. I have too many Thor cards. Easy. Damn. Okay. Now this is the fun one where he you don't want to drip him under like 20% HP or something like that and he full heals. Or is that... I know that's the last phase. I think this is just another one of those you can just kill things. So let's do that. Thor. Thor. Actually, let's ult with Thor first. Why not? Thor. Thor. That. And then... Shion. Sure. You have enough time. Oh, shit. Wait. No. It has a thing. What? I guess it's not the end of the world. It's red, and then that procs, and then it's green. So I guess it still worked out. <laughs> it still works out in the end. My Thor was just frozen. That's cute. Whatever. Hey, decent rewards. Alrighty. Floor three. Let's go ahead and get this shit going, you know? Deer still is like one of the cooler looking ones. He, the antlers go crazy. How fuck with him so heavy. Anyways, let's go ahead and just send the shit. Boom, 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 and boom. I don't remember. The only thing I remember about this one is this one for sure has the if he drops below 30%, he full heals on the last phase. Every, outside of that, I think everything else is straightforward. I don't recall, to be honest. But Jesus Christ. This team is nuts. Let's do a. Simple red. I guess I'll start with green because, you know, I have way too many green cards. Green, blue, red, back to green. 
Shit, he might just die because this team is utterly insane. Alright, you can do 10% HP, right, Yormagander? Yeah! Bro, this is free. This is so free. Shit, don't even make sense how free this is. I just need to make sure I go into the next phase and I can actually wipe the man. So, let's do Shion Yormagander Thor into another Shion so I can get her ultimate. So I can have something to go off of. Because if I have to get... If I put myself in a point where I restart, that's it. We're not doing it again. Like I said, one attempt and we're moving on. So, hopefully I don't put myself in a situation where I have to reset my game in order to beat it. So I have to do this first try flawlessly. What was that buff he just got? Decreased to... Okay, that's fine. So, let's do... Oh. Okay. Red. Green blue back into red that's a good start well my chair is going through it apparently but this is a beautiful start boom 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 solid and now before i actually play i want to make sure that it's 30 or 20 percent i have to actually go look at that before we go into it because i really don't want to restart is that an old drain yes that's fine i'm cool with that i'm cool with that let me check let me double check which one is it is it this one 20%. Okay, so you cannot go under 20%. So we have one, two, three, four, 50% HP. Okay. So with green, I'm thinking. I don't have a. Oh, that's bad, actually. I don't have a fucking Thor card. So I think I do lose this. I'm cooked. I don't have a Thor card. I can't remove the buff, though. Uh, no, I guess not. I have that card. Okay. We're going to have to do this. We're going to have to slow it down. And then, like, just waste some of these Xiyang cards. That shouldn't kill since I'm setting it to where it switches early. I hope I pull a Thor card here. I need to get a Thor card. I guess I could have fucking killed with her, apparently. I mean, I underestimated how strong this chick is. Even without her thing, she still just obliterated the poor bastard. But this is fine. I can remove the buffs. And then apparently... I don't care about order. This team is broken as fuck. So, remove the buff. I still don't have a fucking one card, so we'll, we'll, we'll figure that out as we go. Pop this, pop this, and then just throw this out. Apparently, we don't care about order. Or maybe we do. No, barely. She still hits like a truck. Get a little bit of healing off of that. I mean, I think we're fine. I'm. I, never mind. We might not be fine because we just can't pull a Thor card. No matter how much cards I waste. Okay, come on, olds. Remove them. Give me a Thor card, please. Just give me a Thor card. Oh, never mind. We're cooked. He stanced. I can't do anything about this. I have to wait like 75 turns in order to actually play the game. Ooh. Okay. Um. Fuck. I forgot about this part. See, all I needed was a Thor card and I would have been fine. Or maybe... I shouldn't have underestimated my Xion, and I probably would have killed the first turn. Other than that, it was either one or the other, and I got hoed on one of them. And I didn't even anticipate that the other was even a possibility. Uh, I think I just lose at this point. I'm not even going to attempt to try it. But GG's to that guy. <laughs> but Deer is definitely doable. E, obviously. I just, you know, RNG and poor judgment, I guess. And now we're on to the Skull and Hati. Hello. Damn. These niggas loud as hell. But yeah. Skull and Hati time. With the Thonar setup. Thor just loves showing up in these Ragnarok fights. But okay. This one's gonna be pretty simple. Skull and Hati got nerfed into the actual dirt. So I don't see this being a huge loss of my time. Boom. Okay. Okay. And hey, Milam, how much damage you doing? Good shit. I can get Freyr's ultimate here, so I can no diff the next phase. Even though you don't really need it, because obviously this team is kind of stupid. Let's see here. Boom. Get that Freyr. Boom. Get that. And do that. Okay. 63k. Not horrible. For Thor, you know. My Thonar. My fault. My fault, Thonar. Okay. Alright. Let's just go ahead and ult. Waste that ultimate. Watch this, do that. And that should be an easy phase two done. Boom, 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 boom. Come on, kill. Oh, you left him on one HP, Thonor. 
You had one job, baby girl. Please, don't let me down. But okay. And here's the easy part. We just... Oh. Okay, let's do this. One. Do it over here. Two. Dragon power. Three. Four. And just die. Good job, good job. Pop off queen. Boom. Alright. And mill him clears. <laughs> 5.8 mil is nuts for 1-6. But it's mill. Why the hell am I surprised? Look at her. Look at her. Okay, no. My game just froze. We don't like windscreens, apparently. Phase 2. And this one is just as easy as the other one. It's just that you can't attack them more than 6 times in the last phase. And they're a little more tanky. So, easy clap. Easy clear. Let's just keep it going. Boom. 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 Single target. I actually hit that card. Wait. Usually, the little fisticuff card hits for patience on this phase. That must be Zion at work, according to JP. They call her Zion in the patch notes. In, in like, databases. Her name is Z-I-O-N. Instead of Xion. So, let that sink in. I might start calling her Zion from now on just to piss people off. Alright, let's do a... Boom. Boom. Get that Freyer ult because we can. And then this AoE clear, I guess. Even though I... Yeah, she dies before the AoE even comes out. Damn. Wasting cards for real. Just wasting cards. But now we got the ult. So we do this, do that, do that. And then boom. Goodbye, Skull. Or Hati, whichever one you are. I don't remember which one is which. I'm gonna be honest. I think Skull is the night one. Bro, what's going on with my game? Like, look at this. And then I do so much damage that the game couldn't calculate why he died? Like, why does my game keep doing that? But yeah, this is the phase where you can't attack them more than six times. So, if you want to keep it practice, you want to AoE as much as possible. I guess. But now, that's one for each. It's 2-1, 3-1, 4-1. So, 4-1, I attacked this black one four times and I only attacked the light one once. Unless he dies? Okay, he dies. So, now I have to kill him in five attacks. Which should be simple. Should be really simple. Just don't hold me, game. So, one, two, three, four. Now I have one attack, but he should die here easy. Yep. Good job, Millum. User. Look at that. Now my windscreen's working. Let's fucking go. Decent loot. And now for the last floor of Skull and Hati. Let's go. Damn, bro. He looks sick. The, I, the, I take it back. I think the wolves are the coolest looking bosses out of the five. I don't know why I did that. I'm gonna be honest. That was a weird play. But it's fine. We don't need it. Ah, sorry. I've been talking for so long, I had to take a little sip of my aqua. Ooh. I feel refreshed. Okay. Let's go ahead and just send out Xion. Actually, I guess I'll... Just in case I don't kill, I'll just merge for the... I'll just full send her, get that ult, or not ult, get the stance cancel there. And just keep sending Xion out. Because she's the best girl in the fucking game. Yep, she and Hati is dead. Hati dead as fuck. Boom, 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 boom. Crit chance increase because our passive is cracked. Oof, forgot about that part. Um, let's do this, do this, do this, do this. I hope that kills. Obviously it kills, because what am I talking about? And they, they randomly froze my thonar, unfortunately. Bad choice, bad choice. And now we just kill. Now we just kill. No! Well, I got the three eight, three single targets that I cleanse, so I'll do that. Oh, I need to get I need to get Thor's passive going, so I need to do two of these, one of these, and then that'll cleanse her, and I'll AOE from there. There we go, her holy relic procced, and this should be her passive. Yep, there we go. And now Milim go crazy. Seven. Um. Uh, well, yeah, that that checks out. Taunt. Relax. Milton does not want that taunt, bro. That was, um, not nice. Well, uh, okay. That's fine, I guess. Boom. Boom. AoE, and then Freyer ult. And I think that clears the fight. It should clear the fight. Boom, boom, boom. Ooh. Night Wolf kind of tanked that shit. There we go. Easy. Wolf. Just another L to add to the box. But here's the fun one. Eh, decent. But here's the fun one. Now we gotta do Snake. 
I've never done Needhogger with any other team but the Goddess team. So, this could go horribly wrong. But I have faith in this broken ass PvE comp that I can at least beat floor 1 and 2. Hello, Needhogger. Pretty little snake. Alright. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. So, how the fuck does this work again? I haven't done this in a while. I think I just gotta beat him up, right? <laughs> I'm gonna be so honest. I don't remember how to do this. I know I gotta keep my single targets because I need to remove the stance. So, let's do this. Boom. Actually, let's buff, I guess. Buff. AoE. Uh, actually, no, fuck that. We buff and single target all these times. I think that's the play. Let's see how much damage we're doing because I actually never tried this team setup on this in any situation so i'm very curious if they're better than a goddess setup probably not not even close wait a minute maybe they are better than the goddess setup wait a minute now Ooh, i don't have a cleanse other than shion's relic thank god they still target freya and thank god she still has tarmia link otherwise i would have cried like a long time ago uh boom 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 and then just ooh. i'll waste the liz card i guess Cause she should just die, I, I would imagine. I have enough DPS to kill here. Yeah, Milum's DPS is nuts for this. Shion, she's getting there. I just need to cleanse more, so more single targets, but that's not very helpful in this situation. Oof. Boom, boom, AoE, and just AoE with Liz. That's one. I don't have enough to, for three, but it's fine, whatever. Just beat him up. Yeah, Milum's DPS is pretty good for this. Like, Milm's going crazy. I just need my Freya to survive this t She's not gonna survive. No, she's dead. <sighs> well, like I said, one attempt, and um, I feel like that's doable. I feel like that's doable. I just didn't get the right cards. But, okay, that, that's just an excuse, that's an excuse. The real reason is that I wasn't playing smart and I didn't rush Elizabeth's ultimate when I should've. I think that's what happened there. But okay. <laughs> We're gonna just go do, um, 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 you know what it's called, Squirrel. I know for a fact I could do Floor 1 and 2 with Shion. I'm not even gonna attempt 3 because I know for a fact it's just gonna suck. And I'm not gonna beat it on my first attempt. I might not even beat the first floor on my first attempt. So, we'll see. We'll see. Alright. Mr. Tadaska. This is where you die. This is where you feel the pain of all my suffering and comrades. We, we shall now send you to Gulag. Because in Gulag, you touch rat. No, rat touch you. Ah. Alright, let's go. <sighs> Sorry, I just detoxify. I did just get off of work. If y'all made it this far in the video, thank God y'all are still with me. This is why my fan base is alive. It's because of you people over there that made it this far. But like I just got off of work and I'm tired, bro. I just want to get this video recorded and I want to go to sleep, but it's okay. I do this for you. Uh let's AoE, single target, single target, and then shock her back into the middle. Or poison? Yeah, poison back into the middle. Boom. Yeah, I'm not doing any damage here right now. Okay. Here's the health decrease. Maybe I should have just saved it, but it's fine. And now, let's do... I can't cleanse, so we can use this. That's fine. It's not a cleanse. Let's pop that. Do this. Do, do, do that. And then let's move him over to the left. Because you don't want to keep him in the same spot on his face as far as I remember. You just want to keep him, keep him guessing. Keep him on, the, on his toes. Okay. Ah, I'm thinking... I think we could just kill here. Boom. 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 I think we can kill. I'm pretty sure we can kill. Six mil. Ah, uh, must have hit the the overall health of the freaking devices, whatever they're called. The tree stomps. Okay. Now phase two. Uh, it's the same thing. You just want to keep moving him. So let's get him over to the other side. Ult, ult. Um, you also don't want to cleanse on his face, if I'm not mistaken. You, I don't think you want to ult either, but just because it's early, I'm going to just say fuck it. And if this causes me a run, run, then so be it. But we're just going to do that, do that, 
And then just murder. Let's get this man on his toes, out of the way. 621 on Shion is not horrible. Okay. Yeah, you don't want to AoE, I think is what this is. Because if you AoE, he gets all of his buffs, and that those buffs really hurt if he gets them stacking. And you also don't want to cleanse here. I remember, I remember, sort of. <sighs> for some reason, this is really hard for me to retain the information about this one. Let's heal up here. Pop this. Shock. And just move this one over, I guess. Because I don't want to AoE too much. Almost. If I had another GM guard, this would have been over. Damn. Who would have thought? Good job, Glox. Tank that shit, Kuh. Tank it. All right. Uh, We should be able to clear this one easy. This Shion ult. And then we just waste the cleanse here because she should be dead yeah that's shion bro shion's kind of nice she just she just really is ooh 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 cleanse it pop it use it delete it well oh right i need to move him over and then other way okay so he's immune to ranged but i need to get him on the other side so I fucked up. I can't move him over to bleed because I don't have a way to bleed him. I can move him back to the middle though. That's the only thing I can do. So let's just waste this. Do that. We gotta get him back in the mid and then just go with it. Oh well, let me let me do it again. Boom, boom. Throw that out because yeah, we need to waste some cards here. And just go from here. Uh, yeah, I kinda fucked up here. I need to put him in the middle. Or on the right first and I didn't. But luckily, I had that ultimate, so the run's not killed. And now I need to bleed. Now I need to put him on the right. I need to give him bleed, just slide him over to that side. And then I need to move him over to the other side with uh, this card right here, Kinetic Potential. Boom, okay. So let's heal up, or I guess we don't need to. Let's waste some of these cards. And now we bleed him. Now we bleed him. I'm not sure if I have to do it back over to that side since I've already been over there. I think we're fine. And he should remove his um, immortality-ish. Yeah, it's, it's gone now. Because he has to touch every palette. It doesn't have to be in a specific order. He just has to be on all of them. All right. Yeah, I think we're all good here now. So we could just full send into him. So let's use the ultimates here. Use a Shion. Let's say a Wii. Screw it. Almost. 650. 290. She's probably gonna hit for 300k? Oh no, no, no! Is he baiting fucking close ranged? That's toxic as hell. Well, that's unfortunate as hell, that's for sure. Ah, fuck me. Okay. Eh. This should be free. Let's do that, do that. Do that. Oh shit, I'm not targeting him. I almost fucked up. Do that, do that, do that. And then put him on the left so that I can still attack him with Shion at least. Oh, well, he's dead. GG, 1.4 mil. All right. Wow, my fault. I didn't respect your game, Shion. I just didn't. Horrible loot drop. Absolutely horrible. Now on the floor two. This one's pretty simple as well. We just have to destroy the other two pallets and keep them in the middle now. And that's literally the gimmick. So, as long as he stays there, we'll be fine. So that, do that, do that. I guess we need to actually do the other way around. We need to kill these first. So, boom, boom, boom. And let's just use the Glock's AoE here. Why not? We should be able to get rid of these relatively easy. If the game doesn't keep freezing on me for whatever fucking reason. Alright. Jesus. Um, AoE. AoE. I don't kill the pillar here, I think, without using both of my cards. I don't even think that'll kill. I think it's gonna take me a little longer than I need. Oh, come on, kill. Come on. One HP. Or, you know, one percent. Uh, that could have been better. Could have been worse, I guess. Ah, damn it. That one hurt. He's doing some damage. Ooh, nice. Okay. Let's ult it. Let's do that. That, and then AoE. I guess that'll work, because my cards aren't the best for DPS right now. But Valencia's AoE is pretty cracked, so it should do some good damage here. Aww, oh, almost. He really moved over still. Alright. Thankfully though, I have a poison, so I can move him back in the middle. 
so I really just can't do shit until I put them back over there. So let's go ahead, do that, and just waste these while I can. Thank you, Elizabeth. Now get back over there, buddy. I need you to do your job. He's going crazy. Now, I can destroy this. We bleed it, we AoE, we single target, and then we single target. Almost. Well, he dies next turn, but you know, better than nothing, I guess. Okay, boom. And I think that's fine with the killing part. And we go into the next phase. Damn, I really didn't, okay. Well, I guess Xion's gonna finish it. Fuck you, I guess. Yeah, I don't know how I didn't kill with Glocks, I'm gonna be honest. I was expecting to go there. Is this an AoE ultimate with Valence? It is, okay. So, pop that, pop that, and then boom. Okay, 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 fuck. I just love doing 300k, apparently. Oh, they have damage cap, that's why. Excuse me. That makes a lot of sense. I didn't realize that they had damage cap. Okay. Oh, where'd he go? That's not good. I don't know where he went. All right, well, ew. AoE, AoE, single target, and then ult, I guess? I might be able to kill both of the pillars, and then he just spawn on the middle? Oh, well, I guess I can't. They're both invincible, because he's not on the field. Uh. He's poisoned though. Okay, well, fuck. No. No. That's not ideal. That's just not ideal. So, we have the ult here. And hopefully we win the 50 50. Because literally, if we don't, we're kind of cooked until we get a Valenti AoE. That's super unfortunate. Yeah, he's dead, but he's on the wrong pallet. And I didn't get an AoE. Oh, this is bad. Not because I've. I'm in like immediate danger or anything just because it's gonna take that much longer to beat this guy because I don't have the car to move him well fuck me I guess yeah yeah I guess we're gonna be here for a while so okay he's moving hopefully he goes right in the middle let's just let's just skip the turn I don't want to do too much thank you he's in the middle good 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 now we can kill with the AoE or actually let's do this pop this AoE then we full send Xion, and there we go. I really left it on zero HP. That's kind of nuts. Thank you, Xion. And now for the last phase, which is the exact same thing as the last time. We just have to, you know, do it properly. AoE, AoE, uh, pop this AoE, sure. Let's save some Xion cards this time around because I don't have a lot. I want to use at least two in a turn, not one. Feels like it doesn't accomplish much. I do have another poison AoE here. Am I, I'm not gonna be able to actually destroy the pillars this turn. And then I'm probably gonna get stuck in that same situation where he just doesn't wanna move. Which isn't fun, not at all. But we'll try it. So, AoE, AoE, single target, and then single target again. Xion, you got this, baby. Baby girl, you got this. Oh, maybe not. You're gonna kill that? Please target the pillar. 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 Good, good shit. Wow. What a great fucking RNG play. Let's go. My hand is ass. My hand is garbage. Holy shit. This hand is really fucking bad. And I got stunned. Let's go. This hand is abysmal though. I, I can't even lie. This hand sucks dick. So let's just attack. Boom. 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 And then merge. 141. Not horrible. Now that's pretty bad. Better. <laughs> My hand is still not good. At least I can heal, but like, I need Xion cards. She's the only one I can actually like kill at this point in time anyway. At least get some, uh, I don't want to cleanse. I probably shouldn't have done three single targets. I kind of want to avoid cleansing. That might have cucked me a little bit. Okay. Well, okay, it's not horrible then. I can cleanse here from the looks of things because it doesn't look like it gives me the utmost horrible. Bro, can I get like a good hand for once? I, I got one Xion card. Hopefully that's enough to kill after these two ultimates. They're probably not, though. Okay, maybe, never, never mind. Never mind. Gloxini actually did some good damage here. 640. Okay. Shuna, kill. And then, Oh, no. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, back to this, because I don't have a fucking Shuna card. Pop goes the weasel, I guess. That's amazing, bro. I can't believe it. I just got hoed. I feel like at this rate he's gonna do some stance and I'm just dead. 
Because this has to be like the longest fucking video of all time. And it's not it because I wanted it to be, but like this shit here is fucking horrible. Hey, Shuna cards. Okay. Now, boom. 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 Just kill him. Just kill him. Shion, you got this. Just just obliterate the poor bastard. Never fucking mind. Alright, I have faith. I probably would have been better off using separate single targets at that point. And he's immortal. Come back out, please. Like, did I really take too long? Like, did I really take too long? Did the game just do me like that? Like, I get it. My hand was ass the entire time. But, like, come on now. The game did not just hold me. Right? Okay. No, please. Please. Just end my suffering and kill this thing. Glocks, you got this. Two mil? What the fuck? Oh, it counted the pillar, too. I was gonna say, why the hell did he just do two mil? Alright. That's gonna be the video. Um... I'm, this video feels long as shit, and I don't know how long it's been. I feel like it's 40 minutes plus already, and that's without me cutting anything out. So, we're going to end it here, like I said, because I just don't want to do 4-3 right now with this team. Even though I probably could, I have decent health, but I'm not going to do it. Maybe for a separate video, because I've never done 4-3, or I've never completed 4-3 before. So, th yeah. GG's to this video. That's the Demonic Beast Gauntlet with Xion. Hopefully, you enjoyed the stay. I doubt you did, because... I highly doubt you made it this far in the video, but if you did, comment slime, and I will leave you a little heart, and I'll shot you on the next video. So, that being said, be sure to like, subscribe, and I will see y'all in the next one anyway. So, peace, and have a wonderful night or day. Never watching it. You know what I mean.